have a question by one of our uh, listeners about the scriptures. Here's the question. Does it imply or state anywhere in the scriptures that everyone has a guardian angel? Well, this question was asked because in our uh, study of the prophet Daniel, I had quoted a couple of times that, in fact, uh, Daniel did have a guardian angel. And as a matter of fact, the nation of Israel has a guardian angel, Michael. But for the individual, it does say that. I'm going to read from the first chapter of Hebrews, verse 14. Let me read it to you. Are they not all ministering spirits sent forth to minister for those who will inherit salvation? God has ministering guardian angels for those who are going to be saved. Now be very careful. Stop right there. Christians sometimes get caught up in this and start talking about angels protecting them. It says who will inherit salvation. God gives the duty to angels to preserve his people until they get saved. However, at that juncture, may I say to you this way, he takes over responsibility of watching over them. The Bible says, I will not fear what man can do unto me. God is my helper. I don't look to angels to deliver me from anything. I look to Jesus. I look to God. He is my protector. He is my help. You need to do the same thing. Now be very careful. Lost people make a great big deal out of angels. And unfortunately, we're living in a fallen world where there are millions, maybe billions, of fallen angels. The Bible refers to them as demons. And all of them appear as angels of light. There are false religions formulated on the revealing of this theology by these, uh, these demons, these false angels. Um, matter of fact, uh, uh, Islamic religion, started by Mohammed. He says he had a visitation by an angel in a cave. And that's where his religion came from. The Bible says that even Satan masquerades as an angel of light. Yes, God has guardian angels for those who are going to inherit salvation, but let's not be invoking them, looking to them, praying to them. We pray to the Lord. He is our protector. He is our Savior. Well, I hope that answers your question today. And uh, if you have any other questions, you be sure to let us know. Thank you for joining us. Mm -hmm.